Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Fizz Femme, Shamika, whichever one you want to call me. And today I was sitting here just thinking a little bit, you know, talking to my friend or whatever. And um, I don't know, I started thinking about, you know, people who have idle time to basically like talk about others, you know, like how... Um, how they live in, you know, or thinking that it's some type of insult if somebody went through something and you're like, you know, taking their photo, for instance, and thinking that that's supposed to make somebody else feel some type of way when it's really just showing how ugly you are as a person. And so I just want to bring it back to like, let's try to have compassion for one another. Just because somebody intimidates you in some sort of um shape or form or in your mind because usually that's the delusion that you're putting up like this person is affecting you so bad that you have to find some way to put them down but in reality you're only putting yourself down you know you're only doing you're showing how ugly you are as a person so i would love for my followers to just bestow you know, love on one another because we're all going to go through something in this lifetime. Nobody is perfect. One day or one year, a couple years, you could be doing just fine. And the next couple of years, something can happen. Nobody is, what's the word I'm looking for? Nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. You don't have a perfect timeline of how your life is going to go. Nobody ever said that you're not going to have dips and valleys. It's in the Bible. You have highs and lows in life. It doesn't matter if you have this amount of money up here or you have this amount of money. You're going to go through some stuff, which in turn helps you become, my bad, a stronger person. And it was just on my heart to say this because I found out that somebody that... um. I don't know. I don't know this person, but because I'm talking to a friend of theirs, they decide, okay, I'm going to go on her page, you know, spy, and I'm going to snap a pic of when this woman was at her lowest and send it to this person so it could be like a ah ha 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 ha. No. Usually I don't respond to this type of stuff, but I just felt like this was a good topic to talk about. When you go on somebody's page and you want to take a picture and make that person feel like that 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 is such a bad thing, you know, like that they're you know entertaining this person or whatever. You don't even know the story. That doesn't make him look bad, and that doesn't make me look bad. That makes you look bad. You know what I'm saying? That makes you as a human being look bad because you're saying to yourself that have you or anybody you know go through anything like this, that's what you're going to do. You're going to pick up somebody when they're low. You will pick up somebody who has multiple sclerosis. You will pick up somebody who has cancer. You don't know what their story is, but you're going to do that. And that shows that you're an ugly person. It doesn't matter how you look on the outside, you know? And I just want to encourage everybody out there, don't do that. Don't hurt somebody when they're down. And I'm confident in my story. I'm confident in my journey. I was confident before that. And I'm going to be confident going forward. Because I know that things happen in my life and other people's lives. I, I will always recognize that. To have empathy. To have compassion. To love on people. Because you don't know when it's going to be your turn. And it's not. that's not the reason I do it. Because I just radiate out of love. The reason I do it is because I want to spread love. I want to make people feel good. I have these conversations on my page knowing that one of these days I'm not going to keep getting positivity towards my videos. That's going to come along with the, ter the territory. But I'm built for it. I'm built for it because I know sitting right here in my sister's bedroom that that is not... Nobody's life is perfect. Nobody. Not anybody I know. And a lot of these people you watching on TV and trying to keep up with, sometimes they shit ain't perfect either. And that's why we getting all these aha moments with these stars getting divorced or what have you. You know what I'm saying? Don't put your hope into other people. Put your hope into yourself. 
figure out what you want to do for you, not for anybody else. It's not about anybody else ever. It's not about what I got in my closet. It's not about what I don't have in my closet. It's not about my sickness. It's not about none of that. Because at the end of the day, the thing that we all have in common is that I'm going to be alive through a woman and I'm going to die. And so are you. Everybody's going to have that same fate. So for me, I don't live my life for other people. I will never live my life for other people. So if you think that you have one up, because I'm not sure if you'll watch if, if this person is gonna watch this video. If don't make people make you feel like you can't live your life, like you can't share your truth, like you can't share your testimony, okay? Always share your testimony because it's gonna help the people that it's supposed to help and it's gonna unnerve the people that it's going to unnerve. And then if it is bothering you, I suggest you go sit down and figure out what you got going on with your own life. If all you're worried about is what somebody else's journey is. And had we not had a connection to a one this one person or whatever whatever situation you're in and somebody's making you feel bad, if you don't have a connection through anybody with somebody who is talking about you, just know that they're mirroring their feelings feelings onto you. Never let somebody that is mirroring mirroring their sad feelings onto you. Just learn to close the door, be confident within yourself, and push past it. And that's the word of my day. This is a small video, but I want to encourage you guys to keep going and not to be afraid to spread your testimony or your story or whatever it is you have to tell others. You are important. You are important. Your story is important. Your stories that you go through are important because you can help somebody else. And that's all it's about. It's not about material shit it's not about how you look it's not about what you have in your bank account any of that what's up here what's inside do you understand yourself do you understand that because if if you're stripped of all of that who are you at the core and when i look at myself i want to make sure that i'm an intelligent person that i love hard that i spread positivity that i'm able to lift up my friends that i'm able to lift myself up that I'm able to look inside of myself and know that I am a good human being that's trying to be more positive than negative because we need that in this world. So anyways, thank you for watching this video. You know, if you have anything you want to talk about or you want me to talk about any topics, just leave it in the description box below. And I want to thank you for watching my video. Have a great day. Have a great night. Have a good evening. Sending you guys love. Later.